Amanda. So we gonna let you wait. We, talk we about, gonna oh, talk yeah, about Amanda. Your, what you like in the female? I like I like um, with your sexy boy head. Hey, you covered it up. You. I'm so mad. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what I like in a woman, I like you know, just honest, honest people, like honest women. Like women be lying so much nowadays. They not loyal. Everybody lies. Yeah, women so. lie. Uh, right now, I take lies. me. I take me. <laughs> right now, right now, I take me an ugly chick. Right now, this is Ew. honest. This honest. Like that's oh, what God. I need right oh, now. I don't. I don't had. A, I don't. I don't had a bunch of pretty women. I don't had everything. All different races. I just need me something real now. How old are you? Twenty one. How old are you when you started dating? <laughs> you had nine. Like, <laughs> nine. 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 Where did? Where were you taking them? I was going to their house. Pick me up, baby. They have driver's license and all that. Oh, God. <laughs> Shout out to the Cougars. Cause I, I, I love my older women. No, my brother is 20. He just turned 21. He got a 30-something-year-old woman who be tricking yeah, on him older. all crazy. Gucci this, Louis that. Like, yeah. What does she Why want not? with him? She sneaks into my house she in the middle of the night. She want to feel, <laughs> feel young again. That's what it is. That is gross. <laughs> they want to they they be, you know... The one, the, you, know, you you like the older woman. Though. I love older women. What's Why? The What's the oldest I ever talked to? That is crazy. Maybe like thirty-five. Thirty-five. She had kids. Yeah. How many? She had a daughter, but her daughter was. They say the sex is better. Maybe. You could have been dating her daughter. Yeah. Nah. Uh, someone wants to know who is your idol and how does he feel about sex in videos. So. What kind of what kind of videos? Um, what sex well, who's rap your video? idol? My idol is I have a, like rap idols. Mm-hmm. I like Nas. Are Jay, you serious? That's my favorite. Jay Z, Tupac, mm-hmm. Biggie, Eminem. You know, I look the up to all of them. Greats. Yeah. Likes how do I feel about sex and videos? I don't and what understand videos? that question. Like, I guess. How do I, I feel about porn or something? Like, okay, let's yeah. say. Oh, how do I feel about like like tip drill videos? Like. Yeah. I don't think nothing about it. I I like watching it. It's entertaining. Are you gonna make any? Well, I make a ex- yeah. <laughs> you have any songs? You're gonna like make that? I'm gonna do one. Wait. I got this song called Nouveau and Ciroc. Uh oh. Uh-oh. And we gonna we gonna do it up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> look at Sadie's ass. Shout out to the manager. <laughs> oh, look at my ass. <laughs> <laughs> I got the fucking what's the tip going on? <laughs> Shake oh, it for the people. All right. Don't let yeah, this like, up here you. Wanna, um, let everybody know how they can contact. Hit me up on MySpace, MySpace.com slash Rain910. That's R-A-I-N 910. Hit me up on Twitter. Rain910. Same thing. Look out for you. Twitter. Oh, let me talk about yeah. you. He's right. On tour. And check me out on tour. He writes to making good, like. Yeah, like what's popping, baby? You. Like where you at? Like You're my dream you girl. making good. Yeah. What you like most about her? She, them lips. Megan Good got them lips. <laughs> Trying to see what that be like. Oh, <laughs> Megan Good holla. Who else you like? Talk to Megan. Write I me back. So <laughs> <laughs> with that. Megan Good. How do you feel? No. Because people that be writing to celebrities on there yeah. and they never get replies. And yeah, I mean, I only, I only wrote to her. T- I, I wrote to her. No, I wrote to her twice. <laughs> she didn't write back to you, though? She ain't write back. So I went right like, back. Aside I from Megan Good, what else you like? Aside from Megan Good. I'm waiting on... um. Rihanna to leave Chris. Oh, Get at Rihanna, Tell baby. You, I won't beat you, baby. <laughs> I won't touch you, baby. Come here, oh, baby. God. I won't put my hands on you, baby. So Rihanna and Megan Good. Yeah. I like oh Carrie Hilson. That's oh, like I that's my number one right now. That's my number one right now. I want her back. Oh, we have a caller. Okay, Rob. Rob on Rob. the phone. For the good. Rob. Yo, what up? PMS Radio. PMS Radio. Yo, Rain, what's going on, man? What up, what up? Chilling, God. Yo, first of all, let me say what you can't say. Fuck Corey Guns. I know you wanted to say it. But, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? For whatever reason, you're trying to be politically correct, so I'll say it. Fuck Oh, man. What up, ladies? What's going on? Hey. Um. Why you start off the conversation with that? What's going on? We, no, I ain't got no personal problems with him. I just felt... You know what I'm saying? I, I felt like I had to speak on behalf of Rain, because I felt like... <laughs> wow. 
know what I mean? He wanted to say it, but he was trying to be politically correct. So Rain is a grown man. He didn't say it. So speak for himself. We keep There's politics involved, so I'm just saying fuck Corey Gunn. I didn't even know Corey Gunn. He's a little cute little nigga, whatever. Woo! Nah, no homo. Uh, <laughs> yo, Rain. Yeah. I heard your shit, man. I'm liking it, man. I appreciate it. No doubt. I really appreciate it, man. Think about, like, this, you have established artists coming out, man. They go on wood. Is that discouraging to you? Nah, um, I don't I don't think too much about it, you know what I'm saying? Because I feel like it's reasons, by, it's reasons behind that. And a lot of, a lot of the, um, the artists that are coming out and not, not really doing the numbers they're supposed to, supposed to be doing right. is because they're not putting in the work they're supposed to be putting in. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can't wait on the record labels to, um, to promote you. You got to go out here and get it yourself. You got to work yeah. 20 times harder. There's also, you know, illegal downloading. Yeah, yeah. Well, um. Yeah, but if somebody's feeling if somebody's feeling your music, they gonna go get it. You know what I'm saying? Like Jada just did 130,000 this week. That is amazing. Yeah, but it's, five years ago that would have been like 230. Yeah, yeah, but I mean, people sell records. You got Ti selling 400,000 when he come out. You got Wayne doing a million. You know, you gotta just you guys come with something people wanna hear. If somebody like you, they gonna buy the album. But I'm not really worried about that. As long as I can really you know satisfy my my core audience, you know, I'll be cool. Yeah, well, I, li- I lived in New York for a long time, man, but... You in North Carolina, and did the South really kill hip-hop? Probably. Did the South kill hip-hop? Um, no, nah, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't believe that. No, nah, I don't think that. Thank <laughs> <laughs> But you understand, but, Dirty like, what people, gotta, what people gotta understand is, um, all of that is a part of hip-hop. You know what I'm saying? You had the Pee Wee Herman, you had dances like the Pee Wee Herman back in the day. You had the, you had the Tootsie Roll, you had the Butterfly, like... They it's it's hip hop. You got chicken noodle soup in New York. You know what I'm saying? You got. No, that was whack too, you know what I'm saying? Like, so it's all it's all it's all different forms of hip hop. That that's stuff they use to get the party started. And you know, you always had like different different types of hip hop. You know what I'm saying? So I can't say they kill hip hop because it's it's some real rappers down south. Like you got people like Outkast. You got Ti that's, that's really rhyming. You got Rick Ross that's really rapping. You got you know what I'm saying? You got certain artists that's really going in. Yeah, New York, New York. Yeah, I get yeah. I, this is what started that. You know what I'm saying? New York is what started that. So, yeah, I, I uh, most a lot of my favorite rappers are from are from New York. But um, I'm I'm a big I'm a big fan of Tupac. I'm a big I'm a big fan of Scarface. Scarface is one of my favorite rappers. You know what I'm saying? When I name my favorite rappers, I don't put them in no particular order. I just like something from all of them. No, it ain't, it ain't like that where I'm at, man. I used to go to North Carolina. I went down to New Orleans, all of that, and then I saw the Confederate flag. It's crazy, man. But no, nah, it's, it's not like that, man. Slaves and whatnot. It made me a little nervous and stuff, but... Come to Fayetteville, man. It's, 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 right now, I haven't heard really anybody coming out of North Carolina right now, so you putting the, you putting the whole state on your back. Yeah, I'm riding. I'm riding, man. The savior. I'm riding, man. New York is coming back, too, though, so... New York is coming back. We had we had Jada Cat. do some numbers. What you said? New York never went nowhere. Okay. He said, he said the only two people that what you say, Jim Jones and Jada Cat. As far as right now. Oh come on, New York never went nowhere, man. It's all good. All right, um, this Rob. Now, out of these two ladies, which one would you smash? Oh. That's my last. Which one would you be? Damn, I would like to have both of them at the same time. <laughs> Okay, but we going to commercial break on that note. Thank you for calling Rob <laughs> Thank and you. showing love. Call us 212-283-3437. Let's get into yeah, yeah. one more song from Rain and then he will oh my God. come back with his freestyle. Y'all trying to kill me over here. you got it. Yeah. Call us. I try to tell niggas this game ain't for everybody. <laughs> I know 